Hello, sport card collectors, and welcome back to a special episode of Beat the Odds Card Breaks. Special because we are going to do something that we kind of like to do. It's relatively new here on the channel. We're going to do a uh, Pack War draft version. Um, we're going to crack these guys open here and sort through the packs and each pick one uh, by one the packs that we want to use to try and gain points. Alicia's going to be ripping open here with me. In total, we're going to each have... Uh, I believe it's going to be nine regular packs and three mm -hmm. of the pink packs. So 12 packs total that we're going to use to try and come out with the highest score. Before we get to the pack ripping though, we wanted to go take a little bit of time to go over our subscriber giveaways. At 50 subscribers, we're going to be giving away the Clayton Kershaw uh, Gypsy Queen 2020 Jackie Robinson Day uh, Parallel. So we're going to give a lucky uh, subscriber that card. And then at 100 subscribers, we're going to be doing a draw for that Mike Trout Prism Refractor from 2020 Topps Chrome. So there's a lot of really cool things uh, happening on the channel here. Stay tuned for this. If you haven't subscribed yet, it's you have a chance to get in on this. Because it's only subscribers that are going to win these... Uh, these rewards here, not going to give it away to somebody who's not subscribed to the channel. Uh, also a note, if you are subscribed, make sure that you set your settings to public so I can actually see that you're subscribed to the channel, otherwise there's no way I can actually figure out who to give the rewards to. Um, so we've got the Chrome cards all out here, except for these guys there, now we're all good to go. Um, all the packs are open. We've got the tops cards and the sepia cards here ready to go. Let's start the draft. We're going to start with the base cards and then we'll pick the, uh, not the sepia cards, sorry, the pink refractor cards after that. I'll start first or you want, actually, you know what, ladies first. You get to start. That was the part, that was the pack I was going to pick. I'm just joking. <laughs> uh, let's get, I'll take this one here. She went there. I'll go here. She's going there. I will go here. And we keep doing this until we run out of packs. This way here, it's completely random. We don't know about sequence or anything like that there. It's just who was able to pick uh, the best packs here out of the lot. And I'll take that one there. So we got our nine packs here. Now we got six uh, refractor packs. Uh, go ahead and you can choose the first one there. I will take uh, that one here. And I'll take this one and then left with that. Okay, perfect. So we've got our packs chosen out here. We're going to get to ripping. This product has been fun to open. Um, if I see the stuff on the shelves, you know, it's going to be hard to pass it up here because it's a hot product and it's a lot of fun to open. This is one of the funnest sets that I've opened here all year. Uh, so I'm going to be on the lookout if I ever find some here. I'm looking to see if we can get some. It's just been fun to rip. And I hope you guys have been enjoying it on the channel here too. Okay, let's get going. Uh, pack number one, do you want to start us off? Sure. Okay, here we go. Pack number one, let's go. Got one touches ready just in case. Uh, top loaders and sleeves just in case. Carlos Correa is going to be the first one out. Tommy Edmond after that. There, oh, there we go. That's a green parallel. Willens Astudio. That's going to be numbered to 99. So that's a nice card. Unfortunately, not going to score any points. And there's a Joey Votto in a refractor, a uh, prism refractor after that. We can put the prism refractor on there as well. Uh, it's too bad it's a Willens Astudio. I really don't see the draw to him being a future star. I think it's more just a, hey, you know, he's a fun guy. Everybody likes the Tortuga. But hey, if you, uh, if, you can shed some insight as to why we need to uh, consider him one of the future stars of the league. Please leave a comment down below. I'd be interested to getting your take on that. Uh, Mookie Betts is going to be the first out of my pack. Nolan Arenado comes after him. And then I've got a David Peralta. And looks like I'm going to have a prism, ref or not a prism, just a regular refractor, <laughs> Chris Archer. Um, there's certain cards that uh, Alicia Snickers, that is one of them. She's a big fan of the facial expressions on that card. Uh, moving on to Alicia's pack. Nobody's put any points on the board yet, but uh, we're about to score one. There's a Nico Horner. So that's going to be worth, uh, I believe that's five points. No, sorry, six points for that one. 
Uh, who's that? Jo Jose Ramirez. I almost said Jose. Wow. Jose Ramirez. And then we got our Eric Hosmer after him. And then a Paul DeYoung. That's another Prism Refractor by the looks of it. So you're two for two for Prism Refractors here. Um, we'll, might as well put that one on the board there as well. So no points in the first one. And you got six points in your second pack. Moving on to my second pack. Let's see if I've got an answer in this pack here. Nice pull on the green Astudio, just out of principle, but uh, still wish it was a bit of a better name. Uh, Yuan Moncada, Cattell Marte, so nothing really there. And there is a Masahiro Tanaka, so still nothing. And a Brock Burke, so that's something there. That's a Brock Burke and a Refractor. Uh, that's going to be worth two points for my score. So I'll put that on the board here. Uh, two points for me. But I'm behind six to two. There's shaking going on over here. I think she's got a good card. Victor Reyes to start. There's a Paul DeYoung. And then we've got a Ramon Laureano. And then we have Mike Trout. No, yes, Mike Trout. Um, after that. So uh, nice card. No points, though, for that card. But uh, always nice to pull a nice player. Oh, yeah, you'll, you'll put him on the board. He's, uh, honestly, he's way more deserving of the Will uh, than the Willens Astudio. Kind of wish that we had the Astudio in, or the Trout, sorry, in the green. But you don't really get your choice in cards that you get. Uh, John Means is the first one out of my pack. There's a Seth Brown. And I got an Aquino. That's a nice card. Well, was a nice card. Not quite so nice anymore. And then I've got, ooh, look at that. Bo Bichette. I'll take the bow. Uh, just a regular bow. Uh, insert card, I should say. So the Aquino is going to score me uh, five points. The Brown, I believe, behind him will score me one. That's six. And then that bow is going to score me ten. So 16 points for me in that round brings my total to 18. Let's see what we get in this pack. Walker Bueller. Then we've got a Shoei Otani. And an Albert Pujols, and looks like you're going to get another Prism Refractor. This one's going to be Ronald Guzman. We can put that one down below here. Um, no, oh no, yeah, no points for you in that pack here. You're kind of stuck on six. Let's see if we can get uh, you open up some nicer cards here on the next pack. But we'll see what's in mine first. Andrelton Simmons. There's Bryce. Uh, Tim Anderson. I've got a 25, that's AJ Puck. So one point for Puck. We'll put him down there. I don't think I've got another insert in here. No, I don't. These are all, okay, all refractors. Okay, so I'll take the point 19 to six. Here it is, I, I, I smell a big card coming out of this one. Uh, Willie Adamez, Rowdy Telez, not that one. Kent, Danny Jensen, not that one either. Joey Gallo in the refractor. Okay, so I don't know what I was smelling. Um, obviously nothing. Obviously nothing. There was nothing really there. Okay, let's move on to mine. She's stuck on six. This is my opportunity to push a little ahead, of, uh, push a little bit more ahead of her. Alex Young is going to help. That's one. Logan Allen will be two. And I've got a die cut coming up here. Johnny Bench. And then we've got a Vladdy in the... Uh, Tops 85, the 35th anniversary card. So we'll put that one down below here as well. I'll take two points, pushes my score to 21. Moving on here, let's see what we're going to get in our next pack. So starting us off is a Juan Moncada. I see a smile here. Uh, Cattell Marte. There's an Eugenio Suarez. And there's a rookie card. Did we... Oh, we didn't. No. Oh, you did. Wow. There it is. Is that? That's the refractor. Yeah. So that is Luis Robert. I am getting the one touch ready for that one. Luis Robert in the refractor. That is the best pull of the video so far. And a big score for points for Alicia. It is now... Nicely secured in the refractor there, or in the one touch, my goodness. There it is, folks. Beautiful card. That is going in the best pull spot. Gotta say, these value packs, they're just insane. They are providing such good value. 
Uh, we've been pulling some monster, monster cards out of this, out of these packs here. So another 22 points here for you. That is going to push your score to 28. Nice, nice pull. Beautiful, beautiful card for sure. All right, let's see if I can answer in my pack. <laughs> She doesn't believe anything's going to come that's good of it. Maybe she's right. Let's see. Victor Reyes is going to be my first card. There's a Paul DeYoung, so nothing spectacular yet. Javi Baez, and then my last card is a Keston Hira. So she was right. Uh, nothing came out of my pack. My scar holds a 21. So she's got, all of a sudden, she's got a lead. She's adding to it. <laughs> She yep. likes looking at the back of the pack here. She's spoiling it a little bit for, for us, but uh, she has fun, so that's all that matters. I don't know what's happening here, but my phone's going off. Looks like we just stepped in a casino. There we go. Um, all right, at Alberto Monesty, Dansby Swanson. There is a Jorge Soler. And then the last card, Bo Bichette again. Nice. So we're going to put that next to the other Bo Bichette, and that's going to score you another 10 points. So 38... Uh, total points there for her, 10 points in that round. So if you have to get a double in this episode, to get a Boba Chef double, there's no complaining there. Um, all right. Oh. Do you think your theory's right again? Uh, well, the last time, the last time this happened here, I didn't get the card I hoped I was going to get, but I did get it, we did get it in a later pack. So let's see if it's going to come behind him. My theory is that we're going to see another Robert. Am I right? I am right. I can tell right off the bat here. His bat is in the exact same spot as the bat that's on the card to the left here. Ready? Three, two, one. Luis Robert! Hey! There we go. That's going to get me back into this here big time. Uh, and it's also going to replace something on the board here. We'll take off the, I like the Votto maybe a little bit better than the De Young. That Luis Robert, I'm going to get that sleeved up here for sure. Tyler Glass now uh, behind him. And then we've got, oh, nice, Kyle Lewis too. This has been a really nice pack. There's a Kyle Lewis in the tops uh, 35 here. I'm starting to lose my train of thought, and I don't know where the rest of my uh, sleeves went to. So we're going to have to keep these ones. Well, you know what? I don't like putting this on here without a sleeve, but we're going to do that for now. And then the Kyle Lewis, we're going to use that to replace the... Oh, you know what? We'll place the Votto with the Kyle Lewis. That's a, that's a nice card to get there. So we got two big cards here. 11 points for the Robert and 8 points for the Lewis is 19. I'm back in the lead here. I've got 40 and she's got 38. So it's real close now. Coming down to the wire. Manny Machado. There's a Vladimir Guerrero Jr., and then we've got a Jeff McNeil behind that. And the last card is going to be a Colin Moran. And that looks like that's a refractor. So no points on that pack here. Her score holds at 38. Moving on to my pack. We've got, I've got two more regular packs left. And then I've got, we've got the three uh, pink packs to go after this. Jose Urania to start. There's a Nico. So that's going to help the score here. I'm going to score six points for that one. And then Adrian Morion for another point. And then I've got a Refractor, Nicky Lopez. That's not going to help me out. I'll put that one down below here. And I will take the seven points to add to my score. I now have 47. Moving on here to the next pack. Let's see what we get. Michael Conforto. There's a Broodstar Gratterall. That'll be a point. Yusei Kikuchi, and then there's a Shohei Otani. The Yusei is not a rookie. We'll put him in the base pile there. Shohei Otani, we'll put that one down with the other okay. inserts there. Uh, so one point for the Gratterall. That pushes your score to 39. Let's see if I can add a little to mine. It's pretty tight. Oh, you said uh, there must be a nice card on the back here. I guess we'll see. Add Alberto Mondesi. Uh, Dansby Swanson. And then we've got a Miguel Cabrera. What do we have here? Oh, it's a freshman. Yeah, there we go. Gavin Lux. I'll take that. Uh, where am I going to put him? I'm starting to run out of room. We'll put the trout down below. And we will put the Lux up here. So I will count eight points for the Lux. I've got a pretty healthy lead, but no lead is safe once we get to the pink packs. As everything now is doubled. Any rookies now is worth two points, and if we get a big rookie there, you can use that times two multiplier for that too. Let's see what we get in pink pack number one. Christian Walker to start. 
Then we've got a Matt Tice rookie card, so that's going to be one. Jonathan VR and Zach Collins, so that's going to be another one. So that's four points total. Uh, Patrick Corbin to finish off the pack. Four points pushes your total to 43. Let's see if I can add to my score in my pack here. I will with the Jake Rogers. That will be two points off the bat. Uh, Noah Syndergaard. There's a Domingo Leba for two more. And we got an Aaron Nola. And then the last card is going to be a Jordan Yamamoto for two more after that. So I'm going to get six. And I'm slowly increasing the lead here at 61 to 43. But all it takes is a big rookie in a parallel. And she has the lead. So nothing is safe at this point. Let's see what she pulls in this one. Justin Dunn's the first one out. That's two points. Uh, Carter Kaiboom. There it is. Kyle Lewis in the rookie card. That's a big pull. So there's 16 points for that card. Uh, Alex Young is going to be another one. So that's two more. So that's 20 total points for the round. Manny Machado to finish it off. So just like that, you're in the lead. Kyle Lewis in the pink. That is, uh, you know what, that's got to make the board here. We're going to take the Kyle Lewis uh, card off here and we will put the pink Kyle Lewis on the board. He is quite possibly the hottest rookie. I think he's the hottest rookie in the league. Luis Robert is definitely the buzziest rookie in the league, but uh, Kyle Lewis is the one that's performing right now. Um, Logan Webb is going to be the first card out for me. There's a nice one. Fernando Chachis Jr. in the pink. I'll take that. Uh, then there's an Aaron Savale. So two more points. That's four. There's a Lourdes Gurriel Jr. And then the last card is going to be a Hunter Dozier. So I've got four points coming to me and I just jump back into the lead. So this is going to be close, folks. 65-63. And Alicia is coming into her last pink pack. Let's see what she's going to get out of here. Chris Paddock is going to start. Travis Demerit, we have way too many of his, but that's two points. So you officially tied. Colin Moran, there's an Anthony Santander, and an Andre Munoz for two more. So you, uh, you've taken the lead again at 67, but I just need, well, I need a rookie to tie. I need any rookie on the list to win, or two rookies to win. Let's see if I can pull it off. Albert Pujols, not going to do it. Tyler Glasnow. Not going to do it. Who do we have here? Uh, nope. Jonathan VR is not going to do it. So I'm down to two cards here. There's a rookie. That's Zach Collins, I think. Yeah, so Zach Collins is going to tie us. Am I going to be able to win it on the last card? I don't think I am. Let's see. No, that looks like a Patrick Corbin. So we've officially ended this draft in a tie. 67-67. Uh, that's... Uh, that's some work. That's some work to end up in a tie. I got to tell you that. But it was a lot of fun here for sure. Our best pull of the video is uh, pretty easy to guess. Luis Robert in the refractor. That is an awesome pull. We will take that for, for sure. Uh, the Willens Astudio. Cool card to get in a color parallel. And then, of course, we got a Robert base. Kyle Lewis in the pink was a good card here. And we got a couple of nice inserts in the, in the Lux and the Bichette. But that's going to do it for this episode, folks. I hope you guys enjoyed the content. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed what you saw. And please remember to subscribe because we do have contests that are coming. And you can only win if you are a subscriber to the channel. So we're going to sign off here for now. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. We will catch you guys on our next episode.